Constructing your life is about much more than just building a bank account. Each week, join real estate entrepreneur and mindset coach Austin Linney as he interviews guests who are constructing their dream lives and impacting the world around them on a daily basis. If you're an entrepreneur or wanting to start a business, or you just want to hear motivating stories of how others have overcome the odds, you are in the right place. And now for your host, Austin Linney. Guys, welcome back to Construct Your Life Friday Rant. This is Austin Lenny here. I'm going to revisit a word that I spoke about when I first started the podcast because I'm hearing it more and more. And it's, it's an interesting topic to talk about because it's different for everybody. And the word is success. You know, I ask people all the time when I meet them for coaching. Do you see yourself as a success? And I'm going to go out on the limb and say out of all my coaching clients, I think every single one of them has said no. Okay. Well, that's a little double-edged sword there because I respect the fact that you have dreams and goals and impact that you want to create. And obviously we want to keep growing, but what's the success to you? I could make it a case that I'm very successful because I got sober. I could make a case that I'm very successful because I lost some weight. I could make a case that I'm extremely successful because the three properties that I first bought created a bunch of equity that I bought right, sold right. I could also say that I was super successful to lose $26,000 in the start of a business. Because it taught me everything I needed to know about business. So be careful when you broad stroke success. And ultimately, it doesn't matter what I think. It's defined by you. And so if it's defined by you, then the question that you have to ask yourself is, can you deem yourself successful right now? As you're listening to this, as you sit today. I think you can make a case that you could. Because it's not society. It's not your mom. It's not how much money you have in your bank account. Success is yours. It's a choice. And so if that's the case, well, then I can make a case for that you could be successful as you sit today. Think about that for a minute. Really take that in. And so if if you deem yourself successful now, couldn't that instill more confidence? Couldn't that stop you from seeking outside validation? Hmm. That's something to ponder, huh? We spend our life chasing. We spend our life seeking. We spend our life thinking we're not good enough. We spend our life saying, when I get there, I'm going to be here. When I get here, I'm going to feel this way. And ultimately, you can feel the way that you want to feel right now. And so try this on for size. If 80% of what you do in this world is based on your subconscious mind, if you told yourself that you were successful, today and every day for the next 90 days or six months, how do you think you'd feel inside? Hmm? That's powerful as fuck. It's not until you announce it to the universe that you are successful and I am who I am and I am enough that you create the space for you to believe it in the bottom of your core and every bone and every fiber of your body. And so if that's the case, then your subconscious doesn't know the difference between reality and suggestion. So if you suggest, then your subconscious mind has to believe that it's true. And so if that's the case, then holy shit, you're successful. And you wake up every day and you look in the mirror and you say to yourself, you are a successful son of a bitch. You're amazing at what you do. And I know 
that you're going to create whatever's necessary, whatever obstacle comes your way, I will conquer it. Can you imagine if you said that to yourself every morning, how the fuck you would feel? Bullshit society rhetoric on a bullshit Instagram influenced whatever. If you have a roof over your head, air in your lungs, water in a cup, and you can move, and you can breathe, and you can eat, then in my eyes, you're successful. In the moment that you start believing that is the moment that your entire life changes. Super simple. Make a decision today that you will no longer seek things outside of you to classify how you feel inside of you. Because at some point, guys, I'm going to let you in on a little secret. The, the stuff that you were wishing for and hoping for and wanting, you could be living it right now. And as you start stacking on wins, you get more conditioned to it. And that money doesn't even fucking matter because you're just a fucking winner. Are you a winner? I think you are. And so repeat these words. I am successful. I am enough. And I will create and I will fix any solution I will fix any problem that comes to me with any solution because I'm a solution based growth mindset person who is successful as he sits today I am as successful as I sit today and I will continue to work on myself to create more success in my life let that be the bank battle cry I hope everybody got some value from this and we'll see you next time thank you for listening to construct your life with austin lenny if you enjoyed this episode be sure to rate review subscribe and pay it forward by sharing with a friend most importantly take this opportunity to start constructing your life by taking immediate action on what you learned For show notes, resources, and more information on -on one-on-one coaching with Austin, visit constructyourlifepodcast.com.